wine. Lori Wallace joins us in Lodi with more on the Wicked <laughs> Wine Stroll. Boy, you've been uh, hitting yes, all the I've marks told today. You a lot of, right? I've told you all about Lodi, but we all know Lodi is known for the wine, right? So we couldn't leave without at least touching on that for a minute. The Wicked Wine Stroll, it takes up this whole street here. It's this Saturday, and yeah, it's like trick-or-treating for wine. doesn't get better than that. <laughs> uh, so we have Karen here to talk a little bit about this event. This is your 30th Wine Stroll, and it's doubled in size. Talk a little bit about what people are going to get here on Saturday. It has, yeah. You purchase a ticket. You can purchase a ticket from our website, LodiChamber.com. Uh, tickets are $45. When you arrive, uh, we'll check you in, check your ID, give you a wristband. You get a map that shows which locations are participating and what wineries in each location. Uh, you get food and appetizers in the locations, uh, and you get to taste all the delicious wine. Yeah, and what's cool, a lot of the participating restaurants and shops, they're getting all decked out, too, so they'll be decorated. There's bands, so you have live music, and then you encourage whoever comes out to also dress up. Gotta dress up. Gotta dress up. There's a costume contest. Um, there's going to be lots of people. Everybody comes in costume. Gotta dress up. And whoever wins that costume contest gets to come back next year to the Wicked Wine Stroll for free, so it pays off That's to dress up. You also have a great raffle that you're doing. We do. We uh, have a, a, a wine package, uh, wine and roses. It's an overnight stay and a spa package. So tickets are going to be two for $20. Uh, the, we'll pick the winner the night of the event. You must be present. Uh, it's an awesome spa package, wine and roses, a five-star uh, resort. It's best place in town. So the Wicked Wine Stroll has been going on here, you guys, for about 15 years. So you can just imagine how different it is now, right from when Way it first different. started. Talk a little bit about how the wine scene has changed here in Lodi. It was really small. Uh, 15 years ago, there was a uh, few, few wineries, um, not like today. There's over 85 wineries here in town. When we started the Wine Stroll, we had about 10 uh, wineries that participated. Now we have over 20, 25 wineries that are participating this weekend on Saturday. Okay, and I think we have some of that local wine over there. I think he's going to pour do. us a little glass. We do. Uh, so a couple of the ones that people might know, you know, just uh, most popular around here. Sure, we have Viaggio's coming, uh, Oak Ridge, uh, Van Ruten. We've got 25. Um, there yeah, are all there's a the, lot. There is a lot. <laughs> It'll be great. Red, red wines and white wines. Okay. What, what are you doing with that? That's just for looks. Oh, it's just for looks, Lisa. Sorry. I thought she was going to say, take it. You guys can have it. It's my gift to you. No, it isn't. And I borrowed this hat from this little guy here, which is why it didn't fit. It's meant for him. But yeah, come out in costume. Uh, come out. You could win the costume contest, win tickets for next year, and trick or treat for some wine. Why not? Back over to you guys. Why not? So let's see. Lori was 